So I'm currently behind the wheel of the 2024 Audi Q7. And this thing features a few different drive modes. I wanted to take a moment to showcase how to enable those modes and what those drive modes change in the vehicle. So there are two different ways to um, enable drive modes in the Audi Q7, which Audi calls the drive select system. Now the you know, manual way is to go into the uh, media display, locate the vehicle bubble. I call them bubble like app bubbles. Um, you see Audi drive select, click there. And now you can fully select all of the different drive modes. So you have off-road, all-road, comfort, auto, dynamic, and individual. And obviously the name suggests kind of what they're changing or what the ride is situated for. But as you can also see over on the right, each one has a different dri uh, driving height that it will adjust for the vehicle. So let's start with off-road. You can see it's gonna kind of raise it up. All-road, different level, comfort. You're gonna be kind of in the middle, auto. Let's leave in the middle. Dynamic, it's gonna kind of lower you because that's kind of the more sporty setting. Individual, it's gonna raise it back up. Now the best way to describe what these modes are gonna adjust is basically in the individual mode because there you can see what they can actually adjust. So you can see drive, balance, sport, suspension, comfortable, balance, sport, and same for steering. So obviously in the comfort mode, it's really gonna adjust everything here to the left, right? Whereas with the dynamic mode, it's gonna, the vehicle's gonna adjust everything to the far right, right? You're gonna have a, a drive in sport mode, suspension's gonna be sport, steering's gonna be in sport. Now, obviously I can kind of simulate that with my own individual mode, which I, you know, call the personal drive mode, but that's basically what the drive modes change in each of these, particularly with the, the raising of the height level of the vehicle and kind of how it's gonna feel in these three selections. So drive, suspension, and steering. Now that's how you can, you know, manually go in to the settings, to the drive select screen and select it. Now down on the center console, there's also drive select buttons. So up and down right here will allow you to cycle through, you know, let's say you're driving on the highway, you don't wanna you know, have your eyes over here for too long you can just push up or down and it'll pop it up right here and then you can cycle through up or down and then it'll disappear like after five or so seconds. There you go. So there's two different ways to get to your drive modes in the Audi Q7 and I hope I gave you a you know quick little description of what those drive modes do in the vehicle and what they adjust. If you have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comments below. But other than that, thanks for watching.